Good evening. Welcome to the Christian Shop at Home Network. I'm Carl Jenkins. You might remember me from such Christian films as Christ and His Mother and The Apostles Barber. We've got a fantastic product for you tonight. Oh, who could that be? Start the award-winning series, Homogenocide, and Homogenocide 3. How are you doing, Carl? Oh, God. I'm here to help you sell something that I think nobody at home should be without. What is that? The Magic Sashimi Blade! Well, Jesus, what does it do? Like most people, I'm assuming you're not a sushi chef, are you? No, I'm not, Abraham. Well, when my kids, Isaac and Ishmael, want sushi, this is what I have. The Magic Sashimi Blade. It preps, it prepares, it controls, it destroys, <laughs> it kills everything that could be made into sushi just for you at home without a bothersome sushi chef to come and speak Japanese to you. Wow, all that. <laughs> all that and more. Well, I'm not that smart. So let me see how it works. Well, there's only 18 simple steps to the Magic Sashimi Blade. One is take off the tech top like I just did. Two is to put your ingredients in. Three is to screw back on the cap. Four is to lock it into position. Five is to wait for one minute. Six is to wait for two minutes. Seven is to wait for three minutes. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 are to wait for the full 30 minutes. Then you just open the door and voila, you have sushi. Do you like sushi? Well, well do you? Okay. Well, I'm going to make some for you. Since you're a simple Catholic man, I'm going to show you how it works. First, you're going to have to take the top off. Well, first, you get your basic ingredients, cod, and rice. Holy Christ, this seems easy so far. And boy, do I love cod. <laughs> Don't we all? First, we've got to open the fish. Isn't that a choice filet of cod? First, you have to pop it into the magic sashimi blade, like thus. Now, for the special ingredient, all our marinade of God. We're going to apply it just a little bit. God is powerful. After that, first you gotta put the rice in. We're gonna hand measure out there a good cup of rice. Okay, we're done with the preparation there. So first we gotta secure the lid onto it nice and good. Do you wanna go ahead and give it a try? I'll hold on. Well, God, this seems so easy. I might as well. Voila! Wow, 30 minutes already? Yeah, it's that simple. Jesus, that is simple. <laughs> you think that's simple? Have a try! Hmm. It's delicious, isn't it? Holy Christ, that's amazing! <laughs> <laughs> I thought so too the first time I tested out the mind of the magic sashimi blade. Wow, that's great, Abraham. What do we have next? Well, I got a treat for you because you're going to help me with this next dish. We're going to start by making one of our famous desserts. First, we're going to take the lid off one more time. Then, we're going to take one full egg. Just toss it right in. Then, if you will, grab that jam. Well, holy Christ, I love jam. That's fantastic. I'm going to need you to put two whopping spoonfuls in there. One, mmm, mmm. Two, now that is some holy goodness. Now, for the special ingredient, something you can only buy at the Church Shop at Home Network, We've got Christ Crisps here. Oh man, that smells like pure and unadulterated body of Christ right there. Count them. Three. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. <laughs> Hua! I love Jesus. We've got one more key ingredient. We've got three little doilies for our three magic desserts. We're almost done. Ready? Would you do the honors? Hell yeah. I love dessert. Open the magic door and voila, we have grade A top choice Christ tarts. Care to indulge? Wow, I'm gonna have to. They're, mm -hmm. they're so good you need two, isn't that right? Your face. Are you all right? <laughs> off the ground, are we, Carl? 30 minutes and all we have left are empty tinfoil wrappers. Those were divine, but let me christen this a fabulous dessert. Wow, I feel baptized in nutrition. We'll be right back. And we're back. 
Cigarette? No, thank you. I'm trying to quit. Well, the magic sashimi blade can help. With just one pack of cigarettes in the top... Jesus! A whole pack of cigarettes? In this machine? Christ be damned, I'm gonna help you quit! But that's my last pack, and if time won't do it, how will this wonderful machine help me quit? I'll tell you. The Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. That's how! Boy, that looks like a caramel. Well, people have been fooled before. But this one delicious candy has the entire nutrition facts of an entire pack of cigarettes. You're gonna take this and you're gonna chew on it for 10 whole seconds for 70% of the nicotine in this dish to go straight to your brain. Do you feel that intense buzz? <laughs> if you do, oh. it means it's working. Wow! You all right there, Carl? Oh, holy! <laughs> Jesus, my <Mag> God! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Looks to me like he's got the Holy Spirit! Amen! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, folks. He's consumed up to several lethal doses of nicotine with one oh. candy. <laughs> Tells me like it's good. We will be right back. Let's come, come with me. Come with me, Carl. Come on. Come on. Let it out. Oh. We'll be right back. Oh. I can't see. It's okay there, sweetie. Oh. Well, Dave is here to help you. Oh. And we're back. Hey, Ram, I understand you have another dessert for us. Yes, I do. How you feeling, by the way, Carl? Oh, God. These Jesus Christ are helping. That's good. Get some solids in your stomach. Well, the next dessert I've got for you is a lovely one. With the beer power of an apple, some Holy Spirit, and the magic sashimi blade, I am going to make you Holios. The holiest of the holy treats. Oh, God. First, we're going to put an apple in. Don't worry, we'll fit it later. Then we're going to add some Grade A Holy Spirit. <laughs> I promise you, you will not be vomiting after eating these. Praise the Lord. Wow! These are amazing! You know, I might actually have to indulge myself. <laughs> and remember, it took seven days for God to create Earth. And it only took us 30 minutes to create Heaven. Sometimes the fish comes around and swims and... You can chop up all of God's creatures, even the fish. <laughs> mm -mm. Oh.